Hello everyone and welcome to uh, a new video. Uh, today we have the news that uh, low-cost Canadian carrier Linksair yesterday in a statement the carrier put out they will cease all operations from Monday on February the 26th. If we go onto their website here you can see they've listed an entire uh, list of questions. When is the airline ceasing flight operations? Uh, why is Linksair ceasing operations? The reason given is the compounding financial pressures associated with inflation, fuel costs, exchange rates, cost of capital, etc. Now Linksair, as of the recording of this video, is still flying. So if we do a quick filter on Flight Radar 24, you can see that uh, two of their flights, as of the time of recording this video, are airborne. We've got uh, one of their 737 Maxes flying between Vancouver and Toronto, and another one between Toronto and Edmonton. To give you a little bit of a history of Linksair, they were first established in 2006 as News Air and Tours. Uh, then the airline took a, a step forward by becoming Enerjet in 2008. So the, air, the airline began operations in October 2008 using a mix of uh, 737 700s and seven, a couple of 737-800s. Mm. Then on the 16th of November 2021, Linksair was established. The airline ordered a whole load of uh, 737 MAX 800s and finally the airline took to the skies on April the 7th 2022. If we just look uh, briefly we can see at some of the places here from the Wikipedia page that uh, Linksair have flown to from Calgary, Charlottetown. A lot of these routes sadly have entered, ended already. February the 26th, Montreal, um, Halifax, loads and loads of routes have already ceased. They were planning to fly to Ottawa, Quebec, Regina and uh, Logan International Airport as well as San Francisco International Airport. So the airline was trying to expand, it was trying out new airports and new routes. Linksair's fleet comprised of nine Boeing 737 MAX 8s, three of which were originally meant to be delivered to Norwegian before Norwegian encountered many financial difficulties. These are all the ones that have been delivered with uh, the first one being delivered back on the 17th of March 2022 prior to the airline commencing operations, uh, Charlie Foxtrot Uniform Lima India. And three of these, as I say, were meant to be delivered to Norwegian, Foxtrot Uniform uh, Lima, Foxtrot Uniform Lima Juliet, Golf Uniform Lima November, Golf Uniform Uniform Lima. And uh, I did see one of these parked up at uh, Calgary International Airport when my good friend Alex uh, took me for a drive around the airport. So yeah, some of these are still wearing the livery of uh, Norwegian Air as they were meant to be delivered to. Whilst filming at Calgary International Airport, I had the chance to film a couple of Lynx Air 737 MAX 8s. Interestingly though, on the second, uh, I think it was the second or third day whilst I was there filming, one of their 737 MAX 8s had a technical issue which uh, delayed the aircraft, the engine cover was raised on that 737 MAX 8 and they were doing some work on it and unfortunately that flight was heavily delayed throughout uh, that day. So sadly the carrier has had financial and many other issues to contend with and as a result have decided to cease operations. Another loss for the Canadian market. Despite this setback for Linksair, the airline is taking steps to cease all of its operations in a timely and orderly fashion. Fellow rival and uh, low fare airline WestJet are offering Linksair customers a 25% booking as well as uh, a whole series of routes that they already operate alongside Linksair which passengers are now able to book using a discount code. It's a very nice goodwill gesture from WestJet. The low cost market in Canada is a very, very interesting space at the moment and there have been various ones come and go over the years and uh, it'll be interesting to see how that market develops. It is a market there, there is demand, however whether it's sufficient for the number of carriers 
remains to be seen. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Take care, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.